Hey there, I'm Shannon. And since this week is Story Week on MDE, I thought I would bring this little booger on the channel. Wow, thanks. <laughs> uh, I'm Bailey, her little sister, unfortunately. <laughs> so unfortunately, she's my little sister, if you didn't catch it. We decided that we were going to tell you a story of why I am the best babysitter in the entire world. Oh, don't even lie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I honestly, if you, if you need your kids watched, Oh my god, that sounds so creepy. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> I'm, I'm serious, I'm an awesome babysitter, as the story will prove. Okay, so when I was like 11 and she was like 7 or 8, 7 or 8, I don't really know, my parents decided to trust me to babysit her for the first time ever. So obviously I was really excited about this. I was going to make like three whole dollars. It was going to be the best day ever. And I took my responsibility. You know, very seriously, so I went in my room <laughs> by yeah. myself. Yeah, you left me. And it's okay, Scooby Doo was better than you, so. About two hours later, I came out to like see if she was still breathing, and she's sitting on the couch watching Scooby Doo, like she said. I wasn't hallucinating or anything, but I was looking at the bookshelf, and I swear to God, I was like, Shannon, look, the book is moving around. So I got up and I decided to check this out because obviously that's not possible. <laughs> So I got up, and it was not a book. Not a book at all. I don't even know why you thought it was a book. <laughs> but I got up, and I got as close as I could without pissing my pants, and it was a cockroach. Oh, it wasn't just a cockroach. It was the daddy of all cockroaches. <laughs> it was a palmetto bug, man. Like, <laughs> Yeah, so basically palmetto bugs are the same thing as a cockroach, but they're twice as big. They hiss, and they fly. So basically the spawn of Satan. Yeah. Your worst nightmare. So since it was my job to keep her alive, I went and I was going to try to kill it without touching it, of course, because that's just fucking gross. <laughs> and um, I found a newspaper and I rolled it up and I walked over. She was like hiding behind me the entire time, yeah. like scared to death. And I walked over like as slowly and as intimidatingly as I could. I went to go hit it with this newspaper and it jumped off the bookshelf. It flew, rebounded off my face, and then flew and landed on the blinds. And it started hissing and so I ran behind a chair and was contemplating calling 911 because our parents weren't answering. So after that it was on like moving blinds. Like our blinds move around a lot and there was no chance of me like hitting it because it just would have gone through the blinds of the newspaper. So I strapped on my combat boots and my cargo pants because that was all I wore at the time. And I went into the garage and I got a giant vat of like sprayable bug killer. And it was intense stuff. After I got this bug killer, I went in again. I was a little shaken, but I was trying to be intimidating and you know, protect my little sister even though I hated her. <laughs> so I like stormed over to it and I got as close as I could. And as soon as I started spraying it, like continuously just spraying this thing like crazy, it just started hissing at me and there was nothing I could do. It wouldn't die. <laughs> It was so big. It, uh, you know how cockroaches can survive like nuclear uh, bombs and whatever? <laughs> yeah, that was, it was surviving this. And at that point, I realized there was no hope. All hope was lost, and me and Bailey were going to die <laughs> in a cockroach infested house. <laughs> a one cockroach infested house. <laughs> we decided to do the only thing we knew how to do, and we ran to the bathroom. <laughs> we ran to the bathroom with the phone. Our parents weren't answering, and so we stayed in there for like four hours. Yeah, we stayed in the bathroom <laughs> for literally four hours and cried the whole time. I sat in the same home. sat on the toilet. <laughs> yeah, it was a very, very sad day. Yeah, that's the story of how I uh, won Best Babysitter of the Year, obviously. <laughs> yeah, totally. <laughs> I'm sure she can attest. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the story of uh, the killer cockroach. It will haunt me in my dreams for the rest of my life, so me there's too. that. <laughs> yeah. Um, my sister Bailey actually also has a YouTube channel, so I'm going to annotate that on her face. Click it if you want to see her videos, she's pretty awesome. Um, my face is annotated right now too, if you want to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I have all my links in the description, including my personal channel, and my Twitter, which you should follow, my Instagram, whatever. Just yeah, go check it out. Yeah, I love you guys so much. Thank you for listening to this really awful story. <laughs> yeah, thank you. <laughs> and I will see you in my next video next week. Bye, guys. Bye. <laughs>